Hey Trail Kreitzer at Go Hunt. Uh, today I'm going to run you through my early season hot weather clothing system. So whether you've drawn an archery antelope tag, an early season spot and stock mule deer tag, or even some of those August elk hunts. Uh, so if you're looking for an early season hot weather clothing system, these are some excellent options. All of this we have available in the Go Hunt gear shop. So I'm just going to jump in and run you through my base layers uh, all the way up through my uh, outer layers. Uh, the first item I have here for you is the Saks Hot Shot uh, Boxer Brief. Uh, these are made by this cool company called Saks, um, appropriately named for this ballpark pouch they've got here in the front. Uh, the way they like to explain that is they have a little pouch there, it's essentially going to keep your furniture away from your walls. So on those hot early season hunts, when chafing might be an issue, this is an excellent option. Uh, these have some added technology they call drop temp, which is supposed to cool uh, your unit. Cool your unit. <laughs> Uh, these hot shot boxers also have some added technology that they call drop temp, which essentially uh, helps you regulate temperature. So on an early season hunt, uh, this is an excellent option. Very breathable, they fit great, and like I said, they're going to eliminate chafing if chafing has been an issue for you uh, in the past. Uh, moving over to some of the other pieces, uh, the next piece I've got here uh, I'm going to touch on is the Sitka Core Lightweight Short Sleeve T-Shirt. This is a basic synthetic uh, t-shirt, short sleeve and subalpine. It breathes extremely well, the fit is great. Uh, mostly this thing is just gonna keep you cool. And during the day, you may end up in this t-shirt by itself, especially on those early season hot hunts. Uh, but this is an excellent option. It's treated with a polygene treatment, so it's not gonna stink over multiple days worth of hunting. Uh, this is a really nice, breathable, lightweight, short sleeve crew neck t-shirt, uh, again, in subalpine or open country. Uh, over the top of that, typically I will often wear this Sitka Ascent shirt and you can actually sub these out. You could wear this as a base layer or you could wear this as a base layer and this over the top of it on an early morning if you needed a little bit of added warmth. Um, this is a great shirt, super lightweight. Uh, you've got a high collar here on the back of your neck to keep the sun off your neck. You got a couple of zip pockets here on the front chest uh, with mesh backing so it's going to breathe extremely well. You also have side vents here that are that same mesh underneath your arm, again, to dump heat uh, and help the breathability of this Ascent shirt. It's got a nice drop pin, which I like for spot and stock hunting. Uh, this Sitka Ascent shirt is probably my all-time favorite early season hot weather shirt. It breathes extremely well. I love the fact that it's got a quarter zip here, so if you need to dump heat, you can do that. It's extremely lightweight. You have, you have the high collar, which is going to keep the sun off your neck. Uh, overall, this is one of my very favorite early season hunting shirts. Uh, once again, that's the Sitka Ascent shirt. Moving on to my pants and then some of the other uh, pieces of clothing I'm going to use on an early season hunt. Uh, my all-time favorite early season hunting pant is the Sitka Ascent pant. This is the most lightweight pant that Sitka makes. It's built for these hot weather types of hunts. One of my very favorite things about this pant is the fit. Uh, it has kind of a nice athletic tapered fit. It fits close to your leg, especially through the calf and your ankle. I really like that for spot and stock hunting. It's got some other features I really like about it, including cargo pockets on both sides. You have zips on those. So if you need to stuff a release or anything else that you might need uh, close at hand, that makes a great option. Of course, it's got some of the other features that I really like about a Sitka Ascent pant, including these silicone beading on the inside, which is gonna help keep your pants up. I love the buttons on these and also the two-way zip on the fly, which is a great feature of this pant. This is an extremely lightweight, breathable pair of pants. Uh, they fit well, they breathe well. By far, this is my very favorite hunting pant for early seasons. If you're going to pick up a pair of Sitka Ascent pants, I would also highly suggest you pick up a pair of knee pads. Uh, those come in handy, especially for crawling on a stock. Um, if you're hunting mule deer, if you're hunting antelope, those knee pads that go in these sleeves internally are a great addition to this pair of pants. Moving on to a couple other key items that I like to take, uh, the Sitka Ascent Glove. This is a very lightweight glove, breathable. It's the exact same material that you get in the pants. Uh, you have a very light leather palm in this glove, so you've got some dexterity to it. This is just a really nice fitting glove. Uh, it makes a great addition for spot and stock hunting because once again, you're often crawling or navigating you know, rocky terrain or you know, cheat grass, those little thorns that can get into your hands uh, and cause you problems. But this is a great little light glove for early season hot weather hunting. 
Finally, moving over into headwear, I have a couple of things that I like to take. One is the Sitka Sun Hat. Once again, you've got those same breathable mesh panels on the side of the hat like you have in the armpits of the Sitka Ascent shirt. Uh, it's your traditional boonie, which is a great option to have on those early season hunts when the sun is really beating down on your head. You have a draw cord here on the back of the hat, which allows you to adjust that to fit uh, your head. Whether you got a small head or a big head, this thing's going to work for you just fine. Uh, this is one of my very favorite early season hats. Again, it's breathable, it's crushable, and uh, it just keeps the sun off your neck. So this is a kick -ass little hat. A couple other items that I wanted to touch on before I close out my entire early season gear list. Uh, the Sitka Ascent hat. Uh, I don't know that they make this hat anymore, but they do make the Sitka ball cap, and they make that in subalpine. That cap is another cap I wear often on an early season hunt. It's got that four-way stretch fabric, uh, fits your head great, it's low profile. Um, again, you got a nice bill on the front, keep the sun off your head. You got some breathable side mesh panels. Again, helps you dump the sweat and not overheat. This is a great little ball cap if you just want to use a ball cap instead of a boonie hat like the Sitka Sun hat. Uh, finally, for footwear, these are my favorite early season socks. This is a lightweight cushion sock from Darn Tough. This is the 1952 model. Uh, this is actually one of my favorite running socks. So I wear these quite a bit just on my everyday trail runs. I also use this, like I said, on my early season spot and stock hunts. Uh, hands down, darn tough stocks are my favorite. So once again, this is my early season clothing system, all built within our Go Hunt gear shop. Most of it from Sitka, but like I said, all of it available right now in the shop. Uh, it's all built to be extremely lightweight and breathable and function on those early season hot weather hunts, whether you're hunting mule deer, antelope, or even elk. Uh, if you guys have questions about any of these pieces of gear, drop a comment below. I'd be happy to answer those for you. Now is the time to get your gear, get ready for those early season hunts because they will be here before you know it.